we're back here in the, in the presentation. You can see right now. Uh, well, I mentioned this before, but uh, one of the advanced and latest features of CFEM is that it allows you to, to define a certain number of bodies and also the links among them, which can be defined as external uh, forces. So PTOs can usually be defined by, in this way, uh, just by inserting, inserting uh, external inertial damping forces, just as I did with the springs on the, on the submersible structure legs. This is very, very, very interesting. And, well, just uh, you can see here how as we did for the mooring segments, uh, the rigid links can be linear or nonlinear, are also defined using these TCL scripts. You see simple functions, there's a few lines, and they are all in the user's manual. And uh, also the, the multi-segment mooring lines, as we saw before, but it would be a little bit more advanced. But it's the same idea define uh, in the arguments of the of the mirror segment functions you could include the buoyancy forces in the in the connecting points different segments connected one each other etc so it's quite a, a interested and advanced uh, feature and well to end yes I want to show you some application samples and animations. Here you can see it's not exactly a floating object. As I said before, uh, with CFM you could uh, define very different analysis, like this uh, oscillating water column plant, which is located at the Basque country in Mutrico. And uh, also is wave energy converter. You can see here you could see the the segment, the mooring segments, uh, its connection, connection between each other, and connected to the different parts of the of the device, which is very very interesting. And you have here another example, which is also very interesting for it allows to calculate impact uh, loads on for example this is the same uh, semi submersible platform calculate the the impact forces on the lower deck which is very very key point in the design of this type of of structures there you can see the animation maybe not because i see that the internet connection refresh is not very it's not really refreshing but anyway, you could see how it moves and the free surface moves also and impacts on the lower deck. So uh, this would be it. Uh, thank you very much for your for your attention. Um, And well, you can mail me the, um, all the questions you, you like. There you have on the screen the, my mail address. You can see there, Daniel Saat, compasses.com. You can address all the, the questions and everything you, you like there to that mail address. So, well, that's what, this would be it.